What's going on guys? As you can see, I made it back home. So I actually had a little bit of time to be able to put a video together for you guys. So the video we got today is a um, video explaining, showing how we put together uh, these drags. These are chain driven drags. So basically what happens is in your drag, material falls down into it and then it gets drug to a different location. Pretty self-explanatory, but uh, this is how we uh, put the motor and everything on there to run the chain and whatnot. So uh, yeah, hope you guys like it. Thank you. Gotta wipe the old shaft down nice and clean. Comes with a bunch of sticky shit all over it, so. Take a little acetone, wipe her down. We'll get it all cleaned up and we'll go to the next step. Right here you can see this little marring on the shaft. Take the Dremel and just kind of clean it all up. Hit anything else on the shaft that might be in the way. Another tip, don't buy some fancy fucking hammer. One of these dead blow hammers. Go to fucking Harbor Freight and get you a cheap one because you're going to be hitting shit like this if you fucking miss. I mean, this is a brand new hammer. You can see I'm already tearing into it. Like that. Got the shaft all looped up, cleaned off. There's a this little sleeve piece here. Looks like this. It's sitting long ways towards the back. I guess it's kind of like your spacer. Hold off the back of the thing here. And then this front one goes be the male part I guess slides into it over your keyway we've been having about an eighth inch or so so it'll be about like that where this whole thing's gonna sit so so I just pulled these two bolts out and this third bolt these two bolts here on the sides had these little lifting eyes on them so since these are already kind of long the bolts this bolt is long enough to go through both these plates. Now that center one, this center one here, is too short. See that? It won't stick out past the this other plate. So we've got new bolts right here. Stick them in. see long enough to stick out so and then this is for the plates for the motor so get those on and then we gotta put the plates on and then get the motor set so get the motor set we just pushed it back as far as we could because we're still straight edge because we're still in it just a little bit but we can adjust that with the pulleys so she's about as close as she's going to get for now There you go guys, so it looks like all finished up, got the guards put on, she's ready to rock and roll. <laughs> 